First, it was the Matildas effect. And now Australia's first Muslim AFLW player is hoping to make a mark on young girls from culturally diverse backgrounds. All right, girls, are we ready to win this game? Yes! In rugby league heartland, these girls from Western Sydney are giving another sporting code a crack. A day out dedicated to Australian rules football, hosted by GWS giant star Hanin Sraker. Being the first Muslim girl to play AFL was really, really tough. That's what I'm trying to change for the next girl, you know, make it easy for her so um, the AFL can understand and can learn. A Western Sydney local, Hanian grew up playing rugby league. I used to be that little girl that used to wait Friday night and I sleep in my footy clothes and Saturday was the best day of my life. She would play as a boy. She would wear a headgear and we'd call her Harry. The male students would say like, oh look, they would identify there's a female. They would be like, how good can she be? So they would run, run at her and Hanine would just pick him up and smash him. Her teachers pushed her to try AFL driving her across the state to regional competitions where she was scouted on the New South Wales Victorian border. At the time there was no thought. It was like, yep, I'll drive her there. Did I know how to get there? No, I didn't. I was nervous, but I'm like, if it means this is something that she will excel into and it's a future for her, I'm doing it. Now, Hanin is paying it forward. More than 150 girls hailing from nine Western Sydney schools taking part in the Hanin Zreka Gala Day. Bringing with them a whole lot of pride. Call me competitive if you want, but we're here to win the comp. And this is what the students are vying for, the inaugural Hanin Zreka Cup handed to the winning school team at the end of the day in the hopes it'll inspire more young girls to follow in Hanin's path. She inspires me to like maybe follow what I want to do, what sport I want to do, because sport's not really for girls, that's what they say. The goal of this Scala Day is to try and increase diversity within the sport. Sport still has incredible gaps and I would say some of those gaps are like vacuums. But to see girls kick, mark, tackle, that's a victory Hanin will hold on to for life. Rayanne Tamer, SBS World News.